Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy XII, The Zodiac Age. Alright, so we were messing around in the shop before. We have... The longsword now. The buckler. But we also want to bring him up... To... Bronze armor, if he can get it. Which I think it's going to be... Yeah, right there. So we'll grab that. And then we'll flip over to Voltaire and get him this iron hammer. And can he also... He, okay, he can also have bronze armor. So let's go ahead and do that. And then Fram can also have bronze armor. So I guess we're going to grab three bronze armors. And there's crossbows too if we have it, but... I don't, I don't believe that that was an option, so. Let's get him this iron hammer. I guess he could actually have a shield as well. Though I don't see anywhere to purchase a shield. There's one. Alright, so we'll get, we'll get him a buckler as well. Alright, so yeah, we're going to be spending a bit of money here. That's all right. Let's touch this, because I'm pretty sure this opens a dialogue with him. All right, now. Hmm. Okay, hold up. I want to. I want to figure this thing out. I guess I have to try different buttons. So he said something. There we go. Not working. Okay. So yeah, that doesn't work. You need a fuse for it. And now we can try this button. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So he gives us the tube. Fuse. Oh, we don't have any. Fran has black magic, but only fire. We need lightning or thunder. Alright, so we press this. That's going to use some of our charge. Alright. Now, <clears throat> let's start. Okay, we don't need this. We don't need that. No, 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 maybe? Yeah, we'll hold on to that. We're going to buy a buckler for him so we can get rid of that. And I think, yeah, we're going to buy everybody bronze stuff so we can get rid of this as well. Another bangle would be neat. We already have the one, but... Oh no, this is to sell. This is stuff I'm selling. Oh shoot. Alright, we'll sell some of this stuff. Water stone, three demon eyeballs, glass jewel, dark stone. Oh, so close to the 18,000 we were looking at. Okay, so now...
Yeah, we're, we're good with this stuff. But we want to buy three of these. Nope. And then three of these. And these are just straight upgrades. And then we're going to get one of these for oh, fear. There we go. Alright, so we could, you know, if she had a shield, but she can't use that because her thing is two-handed. We could buy another bangle, but we have one. I don't think we need more than that. That's cool. Got both of those already. We could get to this stuff. Oh, there's thunder. So let's grab that. And blind know while we're here. I'm thinking of just buying these all out, because I know we're gonna want all of the stuff, so. There's a lot of Yeah, let's get self. That's one I'm sure that we're gonna really want, so. And I guess let's make just make take the dive and buy all this stuff. Alright. Whoop, no, I meant to... I wanted to go ahead and sell this stuff. Alright. So now my question is... She can do thunder. I, I, again, I don't know why. I don't understand why she has that ability, but she's got it. Alright, and then we'll throw a save here. All that maintenance stuff is out of the way now. So. Totally. <clears throat> and where are we at? Okay. That was about eight minutes. Alright. Now we're in a pretty good spot. Nope. Can't be watching cutscenes. Block everything I just did? Good mess. Oh, that, okay, that heals them. Okay. All right. I don't, I don't know where I got the idea that he was weak to that. Yeah. 
I'm trying to remember. I think there's something... Like, there's a room we have no reason to go into, though. I'm trying to remember what that's about. Do we have a map? No, we really don't. Pretty sure we go left here, as that's the dead end, though? Nope, looks like we went, it goes wrong there. Okay. Yeah. Oh dear. I think it was right and then left. Gotta keep these charges up. There's the map. I mean, really just rolling through here. I, I realize I'm not saying a lot. I mean, we're just rolling through right now. Just getting these fights. Not a lot. You know, a lot of the time I'll talk about my plan, my strategy. But, I mean, right now we're just rolling through. There's not, there's not a whole lot to talk about. Here's your map. And, now we can see... Yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, that room right there. We don't have a reason to go into it. Unless... I'm trying to remember, is, is this a place we can get back to? Because any map that is, you know, a one-time thing, it doesn't count for the achievement. And I just, I'm not sure if this map is that. I know we can get back into this passage, but I do not know if we can get into this specific section of it. I guess we might as well go in there just to, just to do it. Bosh is completely unarmed. Could I not? Yeah, I can't give him anything. Because he's a guest. There we go. 
Yeah, we'll go into this room. Like I said, I don't think we need to, but we'll do it. Alright, so let's go up first. It's probably wrong. We probably wanted to go down, but... Alright, get ourselves a chest. Ooh, battle harness. That is, like, additional counterattacks? Yeah. It's not guaranteed. I think that's worth giving to him. And then we'll let Fran take this. I'd love to have Valthir get that bangle. Let's see if he can find accessories one, or two, rather. Yeah, there we go. Alright, perfect. And then, buffy your equip. Bangle, my dude. Alright. Yeah, charge is getting down about 90% here. But we could potentially get free counter attacks. And we get plus two to strength, so we'll be hitting a bit harder as well. go. And that returns it up to 99. It would have been 100, but there is still one down here feeding, so. There we go. Now we got the 100 charge again, and like I said, really no reason to do this one. Like, as long as you, and there's a free buckler, so we wouldn't have had to buy one, but... I, I don't I don't have an encyclopedic knowledge of the chests. And considering some of them have changed, you know, I, I wouldn't expect to. So Anyway, you know, those guys would never feed on those conduits unless I went into the room. So there is no real need to go in there. Unless this is not a one time map. If this is a repeatable map. that path or if we go this way I don't I don't recall I want to say we do open that okay Fran you've got fire let's use it Guard. That's a, a helmet, but I don't think it's as, as good as what we already have. Brown, you need to be firing him. There we go. I'm going to need that, sir. up here we want nothing at all something a bomb oh wow this, for some reason this just reminded me of a secret later in the game where there's like an invisible wall but I don't remember exactly how 
we break through that illusion? Like, do we just stand in front of it for a minute? I'm, I'm kind of thinking that's what it is, but... That seems a little silly. Fire him. Look at that. Oh, that's a combo, and Vaughn gets a level. Okay, do we go down? No, not yet. First we'll go up. We didn't already go up here, did we? No. Right, good. Good. And then we'll go down. There's a fuse somewhere in this room. These guys. These fucking guys. The digitation, my man. All right. The gate is open. Oh shit. Parried me. Beautiful crit. Alright, we got through those guys. They they can be dangerous if they if they manage to get self-destruct off, but we were doing enough damage that there wasn't really a threat of that happening. But yeah, this gate that was here is now not, and we can continue on. Oh my man, we are not doing that. I know better than that. I mean, I may take a gamble here in the future to only skip the, the CGI cutscenes. And the, just the conversational ones leave, but... But I don't know. I don't know if that's what I'm going to do or not. So, <clears throat> the revelation there, uh, you know, Bosch got his... Got some armor on. Where are we at? Alright. He got some armor on, he tied his hair back, and he got a, a sword, so he's not just unarmed anymore. And he was sort of confronted by Vaughn, who's like, you killed my brother. And all that. And my king, for that matter. 
But Vosh says, no, that wasn't me. I actually have a twin brother, and he did the shit. I don't think Bosch believes him, but Balthier did. Ah, Mimic! Okay, there's a gate there. I don't think we can open this one just yet. Like, is it a set number we get back from these guys? We're down 43. And that was almost enough to fill it up. We got about 37 from that. Alright, got that done. Fran doing good work, keeping us healed. I think this is Mimic? Yep. You can kind of tell. There's a little different color to these guys. But it's okay. I don't, I don't mind. Fighting. Lightning Prang. That, you know, allows us to hit thunder on enemies. Balance mode that, you know, use, use the spell balance on an enemy. Sir. I'm really quite in need of these lights. Alright. Salamander with Regin on. I always called it Regin in, in my younger years. It, it took me an embarrassing amount of time to realize it was regen. I, I swear I used to get something good from that. I don't remember what it was. I thought it was a weapon. But it could have been where the battle harness used to be. I'm not sure. I almost want to say it was an oak staff. Like, that that's almost... That's locked. Oak staff almost seems like a familiar... Thing. Okay, better mimic. We're gonna get him down because we want to have full charge here. So we're not gonna let him keep fucking around with taking the step away. Don't want him taking more than he can get back. So target him first. Get a heal. And a final chest. And I think we get another save point right here. Before a boss battle. So we are... Ready to go. And this one... No, this isn't the one I'm thinking of. Uh, this is the queen, actually. I was thinking of something else that required... A, a time limit. Like, you only had five minutes to win the fight. But that's not this. This is not the same fight. Uh, 
All right, nope, skipping that for sure. And then, hello, quickening. Got a surprise for you. Please. In the original version, Bond would have White World by this point, but you know, that's not that's not the game we're playing anymore. I'm, I'm, I may make a decree to quit talking about the original, but I'm definitely not going to follow that. Oh, we had other missed charges to grab there if I wanted to take the gamble on it. But, yeah, I, I was more concerned with keeping our time up because we that we spent a lot of time on that one. Yeah, now we're completely out. Five hits though. That's going to be some nice damage. We'll still have MP. We we can. You know, we can do this. And five might be enough, honestly. We're doing a lot of damage with these. Not quite, but look how close he is. Oh, shit. That's gonna be a big hitter. Oh, crap. 170. Only hit Bond, though. Cran just leveled up by killing one of the little things, and there you go. Alright, he's done. Can't actually skip this. Who would have thought the Mascanera could do? Yeah, so if it's not CGI, I'm gonna try to stop skipping. That's the plan. Uh, hopefully, that's to good think enough. Del Mascanera could taste so sweet. Where are we? The Esther's sand, by the look of it. Let's back to Rabanasta before we shrivel up. By your leave, Captain. Yes, the hour of my return is already over late. The people may hate me, but that does not free me of my charge. There we go. They just show us on the map where we are. <clears throat> Which is quite kind of them. And they mentioned that their boss was probably in there when it collapsed. So that's a bit of a problem. Let's go ahead and grab a save. I mean, we, we did just beat a boss, so... So we'll grab a save here. Let's check the time as this goes down. And uh, just over halfway. So we've still got a lot of time left. We'll head back to Rabinaster. Uh, I think Pinello is not here. And this actually reminds me, uh, the cutscene in the dungeon, like right after the fist fight where the judge came on, like those headhunters that we had seen earlier, they, they made an appearance there too. Are we one-shotting these wolves now? Yes, we are. Very nice. Let's grab this. I'm just gonna have Fran fuck that up. Albasha is still here. When, ba when Balthier says, uh, "By your leave, Captain," I feel like he's suggesting that Balthier is gonna leave. But Balthier is very much here. Check for that damn staff, that serpent rod. No fortune there. Short bow. Not particularly useful. 
I'm just seeing if the boat's back. That's, that's what I'm doing down here. I, I don't know. I, I can't quite remember when that happens. This feels too early, but I want to check it and be sure. I also could have checked to see if Nekbet was back. Because we could probably take him now with the three of us. Get in, get in formation, and I'll just bam, bam, bam. No chance. And I'm not going to teleport here, but I, I I promise that I will start teleporting uh, fairly soon. There's the chocobo. No, yeah, the boat's not back. All right, that's all I wanted to know. We'll see if Nekbet's out here. Ha! And just head back to Rabbin Aster. And I, I kind of re recall that everybody sort of leaves. <laughs> and Vaughn can't find Pinello. And then, he is sent by Dallin to learn about the Resistance. And I think that's about the time he realizes that Pinello is actually... Not just... Not just missing, but in trouble. I'm just looking out here for Macbeth. Uh, plenty of see the two cockatrice that are with them. There's always that group of them. Yeah, I don't even see those guys. Oh, they're, they're, I guess they're, that's them. But nobody with them. Just those two, so... Well, I was gonna walk away, but we saw him, so too yeah. late now. Yeah. There we go, hello. Hello, my friends. Thanks for your help in hand. I say goodbye. How about some of this? Two, I never miss. My regards. Alright, now, if we don't get another one, we can now see if Cataclysm is maybe six instead of seven. Got a surprise for you. Yeah, not getting another one. Alright, but yeah, we'll see. There you go. It is six. Alright. So I just misremembered that. I think I'm getting the idea of seven. From something that I figured out, you know, back when, obviously back when I used to play.
Fran, Fran, would you heal him? Yeah. All right. Yeah, there's something I used to think about, and I don't know why, but it, it always was very interesting to me. And it was that I could do, you know, there, the the concurrence at the end of the quickening chain is based on how many of each level quickening you did. So there's, you know, there's level one, two, and three quickenings. And so right now we're only doing level ones and three level ones gets you Inferno, six level ones gets you Cataclysm. And there's always something in my mind that I, and I want to say it was, if we did two level ones, one level two, and four level threes, that's the most we could do without triggering a concurrent. It was something like that that I would think about. I, I was not, not the coolest kid, if you can't tell. But I think I eventually realized that those seven, which is what that it adds up to, that was actually not the lowest possibility. Yeah. And I think it ended up being like one, you know, one, two, five, or something like that was the most you could do without triggering something. I'm going off of, I'm going off of very old memories here, so I could be wrong on these numbers, but I remember 214 was what I believed for a long time. And I remember realizing that was not correct. You. Oh, we might. Oh, we don't have any quickening. I said we might try to take this uh, Surin out, but yeah, we don't have any quickening, so I'm not gonna not gonna bother with it. It's not worth running to a save crystal to try it. another mark available now I, but I can't I can't really think of what the fourth mark might be I know that there's the Nidhogg in the mines which we're heading in that direction now and then there's also the rock toys over there but I, I don't think either of those are the fourth see this no, that's not CGI. So yeah, we'll, we'll I thank avoid you. it. I'd avoid crowds if I were you. In this town, you're still a traitor, you know. The resistance will surely find me soon. Fates will we meet again. I would pay my respects to your brother. You're a fugitive now too. Stay low for a while. What about the stone? Do as you like. That stone's ill-favored. We feel regret. We sought that stone and found ourselves only worry. You offering it? It's mine. Then why'd you ask? Our regards to your girl. We stay in Rabanaster a while. What do you think? Can I trust Bosch? Are you asking the stone? I gotta get rid of this thing. 
but maybe I should show it to Pinello first, so she knows I got something. She'd be at Miguel's place this time of day. All right, so we are coming in the escape. The Moogling is up and running. Hey, my dude, what's up? So, yeah, take me to the sand seat. And we will go have a chat with old Miguelo. And then I think we have to go back to Dallin. It's a whole thing. There was something else I did. I do want to point this out because it's it's a significant change to the way the game is played. At some point, I don't know if that was CGI or not. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's kite. Kite's here. He's like, I haven't seen Penelope for a while. Miguel is not here. Uh, but I need you to go to see Old Dallin for me because Old Dallin had asked me to come see him. And I ain't got the time, I gotta watch the shop. That's what that was. Yeah, I, I made a realization at some point that since I only have three people in my party, I only need to have three sets of armor and weapons. So yeah, I had the Zodiac Spear, I had the, you know, the Tourmaline, whatever it was, and something else, like a Defender or a Claymore. And like I would just switch those out between the active members, you know. I never I never kept the people who weren't part of the party equipped because there's no reason to do it. But now that everybody has different weapons they can use, that is going to change. We are gonna have to keep everybody equipped with their own well, weapon. well, look who we have here. Heard you were sent off to Nalpina. And I got out of there as fast as I could. But it was all worth it, Dallin. Here, look at this. My, my, my. Quite a treasure you've got there. Well, you know, I couldn't have done it without your help. So, there is more to this gutter churl than first meets the eye. Van Ivanerin, a simple favor to beg of you. I was going to ask that kites to go, but I should think that you ought to do. No. No, I think you're just the one. There's a fellow by the name of Azalas, and I need you to bring this sword to him. That's... that's a sword of the old order. Speak my name when you arrive. That should be enough to get you in to see him. I've made a note on your map showing you where he can be found. Mind you, you are to deliver the sword to him personally. I will. Hey, Dal, do you think I could get you to do something for me? I need you to find out where Pinello is. I wanted to show her what I got from the palace, but I haven't been able to find her anywhere. Can you let me know if you hear anything? You can just leave that to me. Thanks, Dallin. Hmm. And so it is done. But will it be enough to remind him of what the Order once meant? There's one thing that I've always been a little curious about. Dallin says to me, you know, I was going to have kites do this, but... You know, I suppose you'll do. I've always wondered... Is that the truth? Is it just a coincidence that Kites isn't available and Vaughn ends up doing this? Or is this one of these things that Dallin, you know, Dallin has eyes everywhere. He knows without question that Kites is not occup... Wait, no that Kites is occupied at the moment and cannot do this. And this was all set up by him. And maybe even, 
you know, Dallin's got ears and eyes everywhere. Maybe he even used Miguelo for this scheme. You know, ha have Miguelo leave his shop so that Kites would not be able to make the delivery, you know? Something I've always questioned. Look at this uh, for a man named Azalus. This place, right? I knew was it that told you that. Oh, down. He said I had to give this to him personally. Ah, does nothing get past that, Dallin? He has ears in every wall. Alright, get inside, but not a word of what you see or hear in there. Got that? Traitor redeemed. Then what do you make of Andor's proclamation? Are you suggesting they fooled even the Marquis? What if a judge killed the king, not the captain? That would explain everything, wouldn't it? In that case, the captain would be brother to a judge. How are we to trust such a man? Huh? Now there is the Bosch that I remember. Then will you fight again at my side? His word alone convinces me of nothing. I'd take his word over that of a mouthpiece Marquis. Then you name Rex liar with him. My brother was no liar! <sighs> Just the opposite. Rex was the witness they needed. They had to make it appear as if I killed the king. Rex bears no blame. The fates have willed it. So this is Rex's brother. <sighs> Your words may convince a child such as this, but they weigh far too lightly on the scales for my taste. Our paths will remain separate. Do you not think Amalia worth saving? I hold men's lives in my hands. I must see foes in every shadow. The night we moved against Vane, he knew. I will not chance such disadvantage again. I must treat you as I would Ondor, as I would treat any of better of the Empire. Then what will you do? Hold me here in chains? <laughs> Some things never change, do they? Listen to me, Bosh. Your cage may have no bars, but it is a cage. The eyes of the Resistance watch unblinking. Let them watch. I know something of cages. That's right. Amalia's in the Resistance. Then you know her. Sorta. We met just before we got sent to Nalbana. I've known nicer people. Our paths keep crossing yours and mine. It's more than coincidence. It's annoying. I'm sorry. Allow me one last annoyance, a favor to ask. I want you to take me to both here. Even caged birds need wings. This makes us even. Even? For Nalbana. We couldn't have done it without you. I don't believe that. I think we totally could have done it. Okay, so now this is where I really do need to make a decision. Uh, in my plan here, I had Balthier as a, I think, Red Battle Mage plus Bosch. I meant to say Bosch. Plus Black Mage. That was the idea I had for him, but I was thinking maybe to give him something else to do. And what's the Shakira? Daggers, okay. Hmm. There's probably something I could look up that, like, there's a tutorial for, like, the perfect configuration of party. But that... That doesn't really feel genuine, so that's not what we're gonna do. Oh, wait, can we... Oh, shit! I, I didn't... I thought we could only have one of each. 
Oh, we can be fucking anything? Oh, man, I had no idea. Okay, this is- this changes a lot. So I could... Yeah, I could make him a knight as well. Oh, man. Okay, okay. So, yeah, that changes many things. I like the poles. I do. I only want spears because I think Zodiac Spears here, somewhere. There's Dragon Whisper, there's Vrishpa, there's, there's Zodiac Spear. So yeah, that's what I want Vaughn to be doing. I might get rid of Machinus. Like I don't I don't care about guns, I don't think. I don't think there's ever a gun I want. So we'll get rid of Machinus. And maybe maybe Bosch's next thing will be or no, Balthier, his next thing will be Red Battle Mage. And Ash, I have her as a monk with poles, plus the shikori with daggers. Okay, so who's using katanas? Is that Pinello? Yeah, Pinello's using katanas. So I think we'll make Bosch a knight also, and then Black Mage will be his secondary. I mean, because he, he, frankly, he is a knight. So, the question becomes... What what have I decided not to use? The, the Machinus. I, I have no... I have no Machinus at all. We also use measures, which is a weapon I don't think I've ever actually tried to use. <sighs> I'm gonna... I'm going to regret this. I, I know I'm going to regret this. I'm going to make Bosch a fucking machinist. And I'm going to use... I'm going to do it the way that I planned. I'm going to use all 12 classes. Bosch is a machinist. Son of a gun. Alright. Well, my timer just went off. So I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye. And I will be hitting a save point out here at the south gate, and I will see you all in the next one.